decreased salmon fishing. We think that the Yukon King salmon fishing should be decreased because we think they might become extinct. We should decrease fishing because the king salmon population is dropping. The population is below average and is too poor. The average in 1982 to 1997 was 300,000, and the average in 1998 to 2011 was about 200,000. There was 19,800 fish last year. That's well below the average 75,000 fish, and below the average of 36,900 for years when the run was late. We should decrease fishing because we need to think of the kids of the future. We need to think of them so they can experience king salmon fishing, so they can taste king salmon and learn how to cut, hang, and take care of. We should decrease fishing so when we grow up, we can have more fish to eat. We should decrease fishing because we would want our kids to have king salmon. We would want them to fish lots and eat lots when they grow up, so we can teach them and about King Salmon. We should decrease fishing so they won't become extinct. If they extinct, we would be sad but happy. We would be sad because everybody would miss King Salmon. We, w- we wouldn't want them to go but we would be happy because we had the chance to taste, eat, cut, clean, take care of, and fish the king salmon. Decreasing would do many things like save them and to have them longer. We say that decreasing is better. Many elders from the community said we should decrease fishing. Isaac Prince says, so the king salmon can go up river and spawn. Hilda Alstrom said, less fishing because the fish will have a chance to spawn. And well, we have more fish for the future. That's why decreasing fishing is important to our community. Thank you. This is by Naomi, Dustin, Frank, Ali. Walter. You've been listening to the voices of fifth graders from St. Mary's, Alaska.